on its side in the distance. This all happened at about 1.30 this afternoon, just a little bit before 1.30. Witnesses have been telling us that a black pickup truck ran a stop sign here on Runnels Street, right under the East Tex Freeway, and then the bus swerved to avoid that pickup truck and then hit uh, an overhead pole here. 32 patients total, 28 of them were transported. We're told one person is in critical condition. All others suffered minor injuries. Uh, the bus driver, we're told, was extricated. He had to be uh, taken out of that bus. They had to bust open a window on the bus to get him out, but we're told the bus driver is not in serious condition. He apparently was the only one who was pinned in to the bus after this happened, but uh, all the patients now at various hospitals. Uh, we are getting an update from Metro right now about the investigation, so uh, we will be out here. We'll continue to stay out here, and we'll bring you the la very latest coming up today at 4. For now, reporting live from downtown, Samantha Batashkin, KPRC Channel 2 News. All right, Samantha, thank you. Once again, a Metro bus uh, crash near the baseball stadium, Minute Maid Park downtown. 28 uh, passengers were taken to the hospital, and here's what, uh, here's what Metro is saying about it. I heard the lady scream before we came right here. Before we got right here, the lady had screamed, and when I turned my head, that's when we hit that truck. That truck wasn't paying attention when he, to get on the freeway. He paid attention, so when he hit that corner, the, the uh, bus hit it. Once the truck hit the, the uh, once the bus hit the truck, it hit that pole right there. We ran out into that pole, and everybody was out. Everybody was messed up. So we all.